All right, actually, thanks a lot. A house fire occurs about every 88 seconds. That's according to the National Fire Protection Agency. Our viewing area has seen a number of house fires since the weather began drying out. People usually, though, associate a house fire with winter months and wildfires with summer months, but that's not always the case. No, it is not. Temperatures are soaring, but that does not mean that house fire dangers are fizzling out. Our Shawanda Jones has spoke with the Columbus Fire Chief about the hazards you need to know and to keep an eye out for. Now this house behind me burned to the ground Saturday night and the cause is believed to be electrical. I spoke to Columbus Fire Chief Dwayne Hughes and he says that there are some activities that people are doing that could lead to summer fires. Grilling is one of the major factors. People will put the grills, uh, usually before convenience, they'll move them closer to the house on porches and uh, they're unattended cooking. Another common cause is electrical fires. And then we have uh, large loads, electrical loads that are placed on the wiring in homes. Many older homes were not designed to accommodate such high loads of electricity. Plugging in multiple fans in an older house with no central air or poor circulation is not a good idea. And then there's the human interaction with Mother Nature, especially when we're experiencing hot, dry conditions like we've had recently. Uh, sometimes outside burning uh, leaf uh, rubbish clearing uh, will get away and uh, will cause those fires to actually set uh, structures and homes on fire. And fires aren't the only concern. We have uh, had a couple of uh, occurrences of smoke, uh, carbon monoxide uh, disturbances in our town. Mm -hmm. And unfortunately, a couple of them have been tragic. So we want to make sure you have a working smoke alarm. And if you have anything that gives off carbon monoxide in your home, you want to have a carbon monoxide detector. If you would like a smoke detector installed, make sure you contact your nearest fire department. They could provide one for free. Telling your story in Columbus and Lowndes County, Shawanda Jones, WCBI News. And cooking is the number one cause of house fire year round, according to FEMA.